Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to show you how to change the base maps in Google Earth. Let's go ahead and take a look here at my Google Earth. And so here I am signed into Google Earth, and I want to change the default map from this standard view to something else. So to do that, let's go up here to the upper left hand corner and change our map style and you can see here i can choose clean and you can see there now i don't have any borders the only labels you see are the labels from the project i'm currently working on if i go to exploration that gives us borders labels places and roads we can do everything and that is literally everything that google ha google earth has including places and roads and transit and you can still go in and turn on 3D buildings, animated clouds, and grid lines across the map. Now, when you do that, of course, it might take your computer a little bit longer to load everything. You might find that there's a little bit of slowdown in how fast Google Earth loads everything, particularly as you zoom in more on the map and of course you can also choose a custom look i'm going to turn off clouds for example we're going to borders and labels and perhaps i'm just going to do countries and not states and provinces and i'll turn off localities and parcels and neighborhoods so now i'm just going to do countries and as we zoom out we'll see that i just have the country border between the united states and canada now, if I go down to my places, maybe I don't want to have businesses or a government. I just want to see the schools and the attractions in the areas that I zoom in on. And for our roads, perhaps we're going to have just our highways and none of our local roads highlighted in our transit maps. Well, our transit lines, I don't want any of them. So let's turn those off, but I'm going to have airports and rail stations still show up on the map. And of course, we do the same thing with landmarks. Perhaps I'm going to have just natural features and not human structures. So that's how you can customize the look of the map in Google Earth. If you wanna learn more about Google Earth, check out my YouTube channel, and if you're looking for creative ways to use Google Earth in your classroom, I have a webinar coming up in August that you might want to check out as well. The link for that is in the description down below. And as always, for more things like this, please check out freetechforteachers.com or subscribe to my YouTube channel.